हेलो स्टूडेंट वेलकम बैक द एम सी क्यू प्रैक्टिस सीरीज ऑफ प्रोग्रामर लॉजिक कंट्रोलर पार्ट नंबर टेन इफ यू नॉट सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल डी एच यू लैब्स आई रिक्वेस्ट यू प्लीज सब्सक्राइब इट आई ऑल्सो रिक्वेस्ट यू प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर इट क्वेश्चन नंबर वन अपील सी हैव ऑप्शन ए अप काउंटर ऑप्शन बी डाउन काउंटर ऑप्शन सी हाई स्पीड काउंटर ऑप्शन डी ऑल ऑफ दिस The answer is option number D that is all of this. Question number 2 A PLC down counter CTD counts option A false to true transition option B true to false transition option c scan transition option d both a and b The answer is option number A that is false to true transition. Question number 3 a PLC up counter that is CTD counts option A false to true transition option B true to false transition option c scan transition option d both a and b The answer is option number P that is true to false transition. Question number 4 A PLC up down counter counts option A false to true transition option B true to false transition option C scan transition option d both of a and b the answer is option number d that is a both a and b Question number 5 in an up counter when the accumulated count exceeds the preset count without the reset the accumulated count will be the option a is set itself to 0 option b start decreasing option c continue de increasing option d hold the accumulated value The answer is option number C that is a continue increasing.
क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स वेन द एक्यूमुलेटेड काउंट एक्सीड द प्रीसेट काउंट द ऑप्शन ए एक्यूरेट वैल्यू इज सेट टू जीरो ऑप्शन बी रिसेट चेंज इज स्टेट ऑप्शन सी काउंटर डन बीट इज ट्रू एंड ऑप्शन डी रिसेट इज सेट टू जीरो The answer is option number C that is a counter done beat is true. Question number 7 the counter reset instruction option A is used to reset the counter option B is given the same reference address as the counter instruction option C decrement the count when actuated and option D both A and B The answer is option number D that is a both A and B. Question number 8 for the PLC counter to reset the counter reset rung must be option A be true option B be false option c b either true or false depending on the manufacturer and d undergo a true to false transaction so the answer is option number c that is b either true or false and depending on the manufacturer question number 9 the plc counter instruction is similar to the option a internal relay instruction option b transitional contact instruction option c transitional contact instruction option d timer instruction The answer is option number D that is a timer instruction. Question number 10 For the calculating high frequency pulses using PLC which instruction is used? option a up counter with timer option b down counter with timer option c up down counter with timer option d high speed counter with timer The answer is option number D that is a high speed counter with timer. Hope you receive very good information from this video. Please like, share and subscribe my channel DAJU Labs. Thank you very much for watching.